and welcome back to my YouTube channel. And today we are te teaching you how to make this amazing slime. Continue to learn more. Okay, so step number one is to pour your glue into your thing. So I'm having my mom do this because she's not letting me otherwise. But the sound <laughs> is going amazing. So I have my glue. And I'm simply just going to pour it into this bowl. Then I'll see you guys back in just a second with my water. You guys could do warm or cold. I like warm water, but whatever you guys prefer. I'm going to do it with cold water because I've never tried it with cold water. So we're going to try that. And uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. So I'll be right back. Done. Now that I've done that, I'm going to take a little bit of my glow in the dark paint. And I am, before I do that, I am going to choose my color. I chose purple because last time I did pink, that did not work out. And then my mom did green. So I'm going to do purple, tie the tides together, and start. That's kind of it. But it's not it without color. So my mom is just going to add a little bit of color. This is also what makes your slime colorful. I should have said glow in the dark. So it makes it glow in the dark. So mommy, do you have any tips for that? Well, just on stir it? it slowly. There you go. If you stir it too fast, it's going to make it stringy and lumpy. So just stir it slowly. <laughs> Do you have my example? No, it's out in the other room. You have to but stir it. There you go. Nice and this slow. This is definitely a beautiful slime and it is going dark. There you go. You see how that's like a better consistency? All right. Now that you've got it, we might want to put, you want to put a little more purple in there? Yeah. All right. Let's put a little more coloring in there. That's where you can, you know, adjust what you want to do, but still make it. Just stir it slowly. Remember, slowly. Slow and steady does the pink. Stir it around like it's in the one spot. You gotta stir it. Try to stir it around. That's it. Just there you go. And here you guys can't see this, but I'm using a popsicle stick. Just go. Alright, and you ready for your last step? And yes, I am. We're going to add some liquid starch. You going to put it in? Yes. Okay, now stir slowly and stir around. Liquid starch is what makes slowly. this slime very slimy. So, make sure you're doing your slime, your liquid starch, right? And, of course, everything before that, but... <laughs> Go and get that liquid in there. There you go. Check your consistency. Can I try it? Yep, you can try it. So then I'm gonna try and take it out. It is very watery at first. Mm-hmm. But once you play with it a bit, you could kind of get it together and make it like amazing. So And you can kind of use the paper towel to maybe put it on there and get some of the extra like water out of it. Could you? Well, I'm, doing it. I'm just gonna take this little piece and play with it. Just a little and then I would just like rub it back and forth between your hands. You can squish it. You notice it just moves around. There's no sticking. And then once it's kind of in like a ball, they kind of stop playing. But the goal is to try and get it stretchy. Mine's already stretching. Mine's already doing good. But it just depends on how you make it. So I mean, first it's probably not going to be very good because my first attempt was horrible. Horrible. I mean, horrible. You saw that, though. Mm hmm. But that was because I didn't use water. I used, um, flux. Just liquid starch and glue. Yeah. So. The water makes it a lot better and a better consistency. So, I like 
smushing it. I don't know why. I like smushing it. It's really fun. And yeah, so that is going to be it for how to make the slime. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.